For now, though, we gotta deal with this. You know, get you out. hit here, and I'm okay with that. Yes! That's exactly how many shots we had left. We're gonna have to waste a rifle shot on one of these things, but that's okay. Alright, what channel did you want? 79, I think? Hello everyone, and welcome back to Signalis. We return today, as always, with the shining hotel room carpet uh, in the place Rotfront. We are in the Rotfront Apartments. With lots of enemies. We have a Lover's Arcana Tarot thingamajigger. We have an undeveloped photo. We have one of the two floppy disks we need for the computer here below us. I don't... Oh, we have the puzzle with the moon's mural. We need a code to get in through here. I don't remember what that backyard is. Magpie box, which needs some sort of frequency of some kind. But yeah, we are back here doing stuff and things. We are relatively low on ammo. We've got four rifle shots we can use. We I don't even know why we have the submachine gun. It's empty. Oh, I think because we were killing enemies at the end of last episode. Oh, we've got even more. You know what? I was saving the ammo because I'm sure the boss fight is soon. But I'm sure they'll give us more ammo before the fight. Hopefully. Um, so let's swap that submachine gun out with the revolver. Rifle and revolver. I would take the revolver ammo, but that is okay. Now, I don't think we have much to worry about in the ways of enemies here. Let's also try just putting that floppy disk and see what it does. I'm pretty sure we're going to need another one, most likely a red one, because this is blue. Get in there. Does that do anything for us immediately? Not apparently. Yeah, because none of these are new, right? Oh, I don't think I tried this last time, but it was definitely there before I put the floppy disk in. There's the magpie box, but we don't know what frequency that was. What does this do? Oh! I see. Do I see? I don't think I see. Oh! I see. Receiver dish, mode duplex, signal repeated to local. Set your radio. Oh, so maybe I should like do that really quick. 210. Okay, it's set to 210. Do we just want to make these cross? Well, that one wants a different radio frequency. I see.
interesting. Okay, so that doesn't seem to affect it. I see. Okay. Yeah, that's all back to static. Okay, so we want that back up here. Okay. And then this one wants 125. So we'll have to remember these two numbers. Maybe now we can open the magpie box? They cross at Radio Tower 43, does that matter at all? Okay. Forty-three. Oh wait, wait, wait. We haven't looked in this, I don't think. Read me! Due to the power rationing, only a limited number of antennas in the grid are powered at a time. To determine which antennas are currently powered, use the antenna program... Oh my. To triangulate the correct antenna. Take note of the antenna where the test signal can be heard on both dishes. In the transmit program, enter the antenna number and select the correct sound file to broadcast. Okay, that... is... Fascinating, but just hang on. So, 43. File has been sent to antenna. Okay. What about polytone? I guess so. And also bells. I guess let's do the magpie one. Oop. Because now... Alright, I can go off. Stop hitting escape. Let's go save quickly, and then we'll try running to the antenna. Or, not to the antenna, to uh, the magpie box, and see if that's open to us now, just by having 125 or 210. Uh, I don't remember the state of the enemies on the way there. I think these two are still down. There's nothing in this one. What floor is it on? Is it on the next floor? It is. We gotta go downstairs. Where's our stairway? Okay, up there. Alright, this might be tricky, which is why I just saved. We can load if we need to. Because if I get down there and the magpie box is not working, then we're going to have to come back. I don't think there's enemies in here, because this is where the fire was. Where's this freaky ass room? Oh yes, more jumping down a hole. Oh yeah, we hadn't jumped down this one yet. Oh, that's, that's great. I mean, we definitely... We have not been here. I see, that was not the direction I thought it was. Oh dear. Um. Oh, I see ladder room. That was maybe not wise. Well, I'm assuming we'll be able to go back. Hopefully. I'm glad I brought some weapons. This looks like a person silhouette here. We don't have the flashlight, I don't think. No, I, I dropped that off. Repair spray is appreciated. This is another repair spray. Yep, that's ominous. Oh, tower. Oh, that's not a good one to be getting. Oh. 
I don't like that that looks like a silhouette. Which is probably its intended purpose. Handgun ammo? No, that's for the submachine gun. Is this like a cafeteria? Public house. Kinda. Shotgun rounds. Oh, that would have been nice. Uh, alright, well, we will remember that they're there, I guess. Oh! Oh, okay, not a fan. Ooh, that is... shielded enemies. Not helping! I can't, I can't see. I, I don't think I managed to get the one that was flailing on the ground, unfortunately. Ooh, 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 get the shield one, get the shield one, get the shield one! Okay. Oh, 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 hi, yep. How did that not hit? Did I just die? I just died. Okay. Well, that was not where I was wanting to go just yet anyways, but duly noted, I should maybe bring the shotgun instead of the rifle, I don't know, but let's go investigate the magpie. Because that was where I was wanting to go. Which means I do have to walk over these bodies. Hopefully they don't get up. Thank you. Really appreciate your service. Alright, where are we going? Straight across, up, and then up. I think I have to kind of stealth here. Yeah, because we have not killed these guys. What do you need? Room 0512, okay. That's probably Alina's apartment, maybe? Hi. Up. Let me just avoid you. I really lucked out with this room. Excuse me, what? what's this? Oh, document. That's fine. And then up. Is there an enemy here? Ah, oh, yes, floor guys. Ow, that was a needless hit. Yeah, you gotta be quick in that room. Alright, magpie. Hell yeah. Store key. Star. Let's see. Okay. Uh, so we can get into the photo store. That's good. 17th Major Arcanum Star. I don't really remember much about Star. How are we doing on health after that hit? We're still in the blue. That's what we like to see. Mirror locked? Unlocks from the other side. Okay. How did that not alert you? Or you? Wow, okay, I have a lot more leeway there than I thought I did. Okay, let us go deposit stuff. Aw, you were doing so good. Well, that's fine. It was kind of bound to happen eventually. Oh, here, real quick, let's maybe set those satellites to one of the other two. Uh, Polytone or... Whatever the third was. Oh, oh, no. The satellites are fine. We want transmit. Yeah. Uh, bells. Okay, what does that do for us? 
Ah. Okay. What about bells? I see. I could see that maybe being useful. Put away you. Well, stores right here. We don't have the code to get in through the keypad, so maybe we take the key and just unlock the door. I think we killed the enemies that are in there, so we should be relatively okay to do so. Maybe we'll hold on to that real quick and go check that out. Um. Yeah. Oh, if that's the case, then I should take uh, this and maybe drop off the magnum here. Just because I'm pretty sure we already killed the enemies that are in that corridor. And we want to make sure we have room to take a few items without having to do like three runs back. All right, how bad is this enemy going to be? Where do you sit? Right there, okay. Well, that's fine. Shouldn't be an issue. Yes, okay, the enemies are currently dead, although for how long is, uh, is an unknown. Unlocks from the other side. Both of those unlock from the other side, okay. Can we... No, we need the key. Shoot. No. Alright, well, then that goes back into storage. Both of those things. And we will go the path that we went last time, because I think that is the only other way we can go right now. All right, let's put you away and you away. We're gonna have that big fight with the Colibris. We're gonna want the Magnum. I guess we just won't take the magnum ammo? I mean, we might as well. We'll use it. Alrighty. Let's see what mischief we can manage, shall we? I'm assuming there's going to be a way back up. There's a lot of doors on this floor that open from the other side. Wow, that was close. And we have to be able to access some of these puzzles again, like that computer. Was there anything else in here? Did we... Yeah, okay, we did what we could in here. Alrighty, well, time to jump down that meat grinder again. That went well for us the first time. To be fair, it did go well on the immediate other side. Nothing in this room. And the next room had loot for us, lots of loot. With surprisingly no enemies. Oh, did we read this last time? We didn't. Millions starve as Imperial Blockade continues. Due to ongoing transit of kits, kites, ration shipments to Veneta have been disrupted by Imperial forces again. 
Millions of Yusin citizens must starve for yet another month as Imperial missile frigates in Kit Kitez orbit critically damaged one of our humanitarian convoys on their way to Veneta, sending diplomatic efforts with the Empire into another crisis. The orbit of Kitez will continue to block free travel between Veneta, Rochefront, and Heimat for another eight seasons, which leaves our Liberation troops on Veneta stranded on the desolate ocean world with minimal support. Convoys will continue to be sent despite the Imperial blockade. Only through perseverance can we rebuild what remains of Veneta. I see. Well, that sounds like ass. Yeah, give me the tower. Is this something over here, too? No, it's not. There is this 8mm ammo, though, and shotgun ammo, which we will have to come back for. For now, though, we gotta deal with this. No, get you out. here and I'm okay with that yes it's exactly how many shots we had left we're gonna have to waste a rifle shot on one of these things but that's okay all right what channel did you want 79 I think Sixty-five. Which one? Come on. I think it was maybe this one right here. Sturb. Systems are just going haywire. Come on. Change the code if you want. That's fine. If I re-go to it. Oh, I think it just shifted. I think it was this one. Nope. And that just wasted a shot. Okay, seriously, can you help, please? Sixty-five. Last time I checked. Oh yeah, that's definitely a proximity thing. Oh, you guys are being so annoying. I hope you know that. I don't suppose I can just. You cannot turn the radio off. Okay. What if I go really far away? I don't want to leave the room and come back. Oh, I'm going to have to. Some of those guys might stand up. Please don't stand up. 51. Oh. Don't we have to shoot them? Well, shit, I guess not. I wasted a rifle shot for nothing. Alright, let's check out these doors. It's locked. It requires a key. What kind of key? Is that the photo store? Is this a banner I can read? 
It is not. Oh, young photos. Yeah, okay, so the key goes here. We can go in that door. Ooh, hello. 10 millimeter ammo. Lots of ammo, which is good, but we need to be able to get back to a storage. Well, thank you. Okay, cool. Let's shove the revolver in. Let's shove the repair sprays in. We'll shove the... No, actually, we'll load the shotgun. Uh, we'll keep the rifle shots. Shove the tarot in. Okay, shotgun. Actually, we'll put the rifle away for now. What's this? Patient key. Interesting. How am I doing on health? Yellow. Is this repair spray? It is. I'm just going to use it. Anything else in here? There's a door. I see you, door. It's a door I can go through, too. Maybe a puzzle? While I am saving and musing about exactly where I want to go next, and maybe running back and grabbing that ammo, I will remind you, if you enjoy this series, want to see more like it, and everything else that is to come, be sure to subscribe. You won't regret it. And if you do regret it, you can always unsubscribe. But, like, pfft, I'd be silly, right? Right. Is that it? Was it just the, the 8mm I didn't get? Or whatever the hell caliber of gun that is? Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, and that's that. Okay. That is very unfortunate. Okay, let's load the two guns. Always a good thing to do. But we are going to put the two away again, and that. Um... Actually, we should take that and that. Beautiful. All right, let's save again. Computer store. Oh, I should maybe go into the back of this room too. See what's in here. Ah, good. It's the way upstairs. It's more Magnum ammo. Oh, it's the way up to both floors. That's neat. That was less neat. I, I just want to clarify. Oh. I think there's a regular enemy in here, too. I really don't like that. Okay. Let's deal with that first, then. have a different gun which means we're going to have to waste a shotgun here where am I like actually where am I I'm right there yeah okay that's what I thought can I not oh I don't have the gun equipped I'm like why am I not aiming okay I think it's just one additional enemy in here 247 Maybe go get the handgun for that. I don't really want to waste a shot. Oh, but it's all the way down here. Ugh, whatever. Whatever. That's fine. 186. Oh, good. 
That was exactly the result I was hoping for. And also, maybe I don't have to kill that one. Reunification. Reunification at any cost. Orbital Defense Cannon Battery Veneta 12. Buyan and Kitez Inner Crosshairs. Artillery Divisions of the People's Army. Oh shit! I did not see you! Oh my god, okay. I literally walked right into you. Yes, I did. Also, this hallway looks a little bit like hell. Gross. A lot of bugs here. Thermite flare. More rifle ammo, always good. Bioresonance technology and its limitations. No other technology has shaped our nation as bioresonance has. Would we ever have been able to free ourselves from the stranglehold of the Empire without the support of replicas? Essential technologies like clima forming and induced gravity would be impossible without bioresonance technology. Despite that, it feels like we've made little effort to really understand or replicate bioresonant effects with conventional technology. Our progress in the development of electronics and microprocessors has stagnated for nearly a century now, as we focus on solely on new ways to instrumentalize this barely understood phenomenon. Take replica production, for example. The process of duplicating a neural pattern from a gestalt host to a replica brain is still not fully understood. How does synchronicity happen? Why is the duplicate imperfect? What happens to pre-existing patterns on the receiving brain? Recreating a replica purely with microprocessors and digital programming may be far out of reach, but I believe that we've become overly dependent on a poorly understood technology controlled solely by a few gifted individuals. It may not be long before we're back where we were under the Empire. Interesting. Periodolia. Ah. Seeing faces where there are none. Lester is not the code. Rude. I disagree. Well, what else can we make? We have L, T, A, R, S, and E. Maybe... Ah, yes, and it's different on each one. Okay. We'll come back to that then. Yeah. Also, is our inventory full? It is. We've got a flare, which won't help us here. Some ammo. I never did go to the thing I said I was going to go to, so those two inventory slots are taken up. It's probably good to go back the way I came really quick and deposit some stuff. We can come back here. Just, you know, avoid all the enemies in this room. And you're good. Do I wanna? Oh, there's a floor dude here, isn't there? Yep. I hate them so much. Ambush enemies. Okay, well, real quick, let's put those back in for now. We'll put you back in, and you, and we will take you once more. Actually, you know what? Maybe it's better if we go a little bit more high caliber here. We'll take our rifle ammo. Save again. Firing shots high caliber round. Know what's best or you better get down. That's a good song. I think I butchered part of it, but that is okay. 
All right, let us continue exploring this little hallway here. Can I get into this room? I very specifically can knock into that room. Also, I should have maybe taken the Magnum. I forgot about shield person there. Ooh, two shieldies. Lock is defective. Lock is defective. That's helpful, if a little boring. What's this? Oh. Oh. I did. Damn it. I didn't mean to do that. Gave no indication. Did I even unlock that door? I didn't unlock that door from the other side. Damn it. Well, all right. Guess we're going back the long way. Oh, you know, we did have another door here that we didn't go in. To the left. Let's go see what's over there really quick. I see. Um, not a place I wish to be. you kind of putz around I'm so glad he didn't somehow see us through that like pillar okay where does this go oh neat okay is there a puzzle in here I feel like there's gonna be a puzzle in here nope just another way to get around Hey, we take that. And now we're back here? Okay. That's handy. Please don't be right outside the door. Thank you for your compliance. Oh, this is definitely a puzzle. A matrix code scanner. Well... Well, how does that help us? I mean, I suppose I need a something with a matrix code, but okay. That's another puzzle. Oh, hi. And that's it that's over here? It is. So now we need to go back over that way. I think you're going to go up. Sneaking, 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 sneaking! Bye-bye. Wait, wasn't there- yeah! I remember accidentally hitting that in the middle of that fight there. Oh. I forgot you would stood up. Alright, well that's fine. I don't give a damn. I don't give a fuck. Anything we want to drop off. Not really. In fact, we'll equip that. But we did do some exploring, so we'll save. Boop. And back up this ladder. Oh, and this ladder. Actually, actually, actually. You know what? You know what? No, wait. I didn't mean to go in this room. Um... Why don't we go clear this hallway out? What does that do for us? There's a door there that potentially has something. But it would let us get back over there pretty easy, too. So, yeah. We're going to get you first, Mr. Floor Guy. Come on. There you go. Nice! That is ideal! Cool. Barring no other sudden floor people, we are clear for this room. The Red Eye. 
There exists a strange folklorish idea in many sectors of Rot Front uh, related to uh, periodolia, the tendency to see meaningful images in random patterns, like seeing a face in an ink blot or letters in a smudge of dirt. It is well known that the so-called Red Eye is simply an anticyclonic storm produced by a high-pressure region in the atmosphere of Rot Front's planet. Yet for some of the early settlers of Rotfront, this natural phenomenon became symbolic of their struggle and way of life. That red spot on the sky became a perfect metaphor for the ever-present surveillance by the protectors and the tight grip of the central government on Heimat. Even today, the idea of an unblinking, watchful eye observing their every move still resonates strongly with the people here. During the celebration of Mondfest at the end of each season, adult citizens will sometimes give students ration marks that have been dipped in red paint. Officially, the red paint is said to represent the blood of those who died in the revolution, but the red coins share an eerie resemblance to that red eye. Or is that just pareidolia too? Should you ever receive one of these red eye ration marks, remember to clean off the paint with acetone or a similar paint thinner. Spending or regifting paint-covered coins is considered to bring bad luck. Interesting. Worth noting that that's probably a uh, hint to the paint thinner puzzle we had. No more floor people. No more floor people. Okay. Unlock that, and we cannot go in here. Okay, so this was just the passage back, but that's okay. Don't stand up, please don't stand up. Why would you even bother? Thank you. Actually, here, real quick, because we did just use some ammo. Let's drop off the shotgun, save, and maybe pick up a different gun. I guess let's just take the pistol for now. That last shotgun shot that downed both of them was really nice. Made me very happy. Alright, we are going... Ooh. Upstairs. There's two more doors to check. And then we can unlock the door into there. completely avoid you two now that I know you're there I can I can actually see you but otherwise I did not notice you were there oh shit oh shit hi well I plan to come in here and double check anyways but now that I'm here is there a code here that looks like a looks like E or a three Looks like an O and an N. Maybe A E O N Aeon. Is that an option? Nice. Pick up Moon. What are these? Are these like cocoons? I think they're meant to be like butterfly cocoons. Does this tell me anything? No. Okay, well that's that's neat. Going to want to go drop that off. Just gonna mosey on over here. Okay. Two repair patches. I don't think we're going to be able to get through this room, considering or this door, considering that mass of flesh there. So I'm not sure why it's considered to just be locked. I shouldn't have maybe picked that up yet. Yeah, there's the red diskette. And 8mm ammo and repair kits. Okay, so we are going to want to come back to this room. 
Yeah, like... Yeah, I don't... Yeah, now it's just red, okay. Okay... Let's maybe stealth our way through here really quick. Where does this go again? Down to the garbage chute. Yeah, it's easier if we just go this way. Wait a second. That was not blocked by a massive flash before. Interesting. Level changed on us. Okay, put you away. You. Here, let's do what we do and load the shotgun real quick. And then put it away. And we've got enough room for all three things there. Oh, oh, oh. No, I actually wanted to keep that. And then we also have the photo store here. Oh, no, the forest photo store is right there? No, where is the photo store? Right there. Yeah, 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 okay. So we could go in there right now, but I want to go back up and get those items first. I don't know if you guys, like, knew this about me, but I'm not very fond of leaving items behind. It causes me distress. That's not cool. That's not cool. Okay. That, grab that. And grab that. Okay. Now, do we want to just hop down? We have the diskette. Computer's right there. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna hop down. Bye bye. We want to go left, left, up. Left, left, up. All right, red diskette, what you getting me? see Medibank Oh, I see. Name and Gabriel, PKZ, all that, date of birth, that rot front, old birth, rot front, rot front, construction worker retired. Severe hearing loss, osteoporosis, chronic asthma. Doctor's note, cochlear implantation requested. Might as well download them all. Fong Roswita, birth, world of birth, Veneta. Replica technician retired. Chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, multiple sclerosis, insomnia. Patient is forgetful about her medication. Factory worker, Gal Waltroud. Irritative bronchial asthma, did not react well to antibiotics. Ito Erica, Benetta, university student, sprained ankle, grade one. Very active in sporting activities. Ito Isolde. 
Shop assistant, minor fracture, left shin, double fracture, right arm. Regularly treated for small liaisons, very prone to accidents. I think this is a girl that was getting, like, beaten up by her classmates or whatever. Mechanic, Ulrika Co. irritated bronchial asthma, darkest notes removed. Lee Saskia, student, bronchial infection, a lot of bronchial issues. Unknown cause. Rebecca Liang, biologist, sinus infection, antidepressant ration was doubled. Yeah, they look like they need antidepressants. Look at those eyes. Nikolai Nguyen, Nguyen, I always have trouble with that name. Occupation writer, thora thoracic, 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 back pain, claims to be unable to take part in communal morning exercises. Yi Siegfried, Cleaner, irritative bronchial asthma, contact dermatitis, repeated contact to chemical irritants during work. White hair. She did not used to have white hair, so why is it updated to that here? But she was a radio officer. She was born on Lang, lives on Rot Front. Insomnia, bruising, premature acromotrichia. Trichia leads me to believe it's something to do with the throat. Premature is obviously premature, but what is acromotrichia? The absence or loss of pigmentation in the hair. I see. I see, I see. I think that was just for some lore. I don't think that actually told us anything we needed. Oh, yes, actually, because, oh, right, there was, um, no, 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 Shadow, stop doing things. Uh, there was a th password that... Oh, cool. We can just access it whenever. Um, yeah. The password was to do with, like, the birthdays of the Itos, I think. The code is the birthday of my daughters. Note they were born on Veneta. Check the last six digits of their PKZ numbers. Okay. Well, then in that case... five six zero five two four five six zero five two four. Okay, we have that password. Where is that? That's like right over here. We might as well go do that. So, 560524. Oh, we we're gonna go drop stuff off too. Whoops. Yeah, hi, excuse me. Funny that that thing doesn't notice us entering, only exiting. Yeah, we wanted to drop stuff off, so. Boom. Um. Let's load the submachine gun a little bit more and put it away. Okay, so 560524. Let's go get that done. I know I have no gun equipped, that's fine. Five six zero oh, five two four. Oh, that's unfortunate. Especially because that was the door I wanted. Five six zero oh, five two four. I 
I'm anticipating floor people. Song of the Gods. Banned. Possession and distribution of this publication is prohibited and punishable by the Fourth Cultural Protection Act. There exists a connection between all of us that few are fully aware of. A song that we all dance to, but few can hear. This deep vibration of the cosmos cannot just be heard and felt. We all resonate in harmony with it, shaping it, deforming it around us. Those select few who can consciously perceive it often fear it. Too oppressive is the sound of the stars, too invasive the noise of the unaware around them, polluting the song with their fickle emotions. But every once in a while, some are born that can not only hear and play this music of the worlds, but who can conduct it. Gifted individuals capable of manipulating the essence of the world around them. Many believe that the Grand Empress is such a being. Her immense will bent humanity into the Empire of Yusin and lifted us to the stars. It was her power that imbued life into the first of the machine servants that now carry the weight of the Empire on their carbon steel backs. Interesting, a lot of implications there. Is that... Is that all? No, okay, now we can get into the store proper. Oh. I couldn't find her. I have looked everywhere, but she's not here anymore. I can't go on. I'm sorry. Oh, are you going to do a bad thing? Do you want a hug? I can give you a hug. Oh. 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 Forgive me. I don't fully know what to make of that, but okay. Photograph of Issa wearing a school uniform. I sold. This picture is badly damaged. Erica. Pick up death? Yeah, I mean, I guess. I don't know why we're collecting all these tarot's, but I guess for another puzzle. Auto injector. There's a empty first aid kit here. Interesting. I wonder if Alina was one of those people who can conduct the song of the cosmos. I feel like that was the implication there. Because a lot is revolving around them. Okay, well that was a thing that happened. It was very unfortunate. Oh, a flesh mass. I wondered how it could be open on one side but blocked on the other. There was another puzzle we completed for the Lover's Arcana, and the door is now blocked by a flesh wall, I assume. Interesting. We still have this to do, too. I'm not really sure how to solve that one. Maybe the, um... The photo we develop will help with that. Alright, let's put... You away... And you away. How many tarot's do we have now? They seem to like five. We currently have five. Okay. Next up is... Oh, and that's a thing that we can open now, too. Where is that? It's that one, I believe. Okay. Well, I think this episode has been going on long enough for today. So this is where we're going to leave it off. Thank you to everyone for joining me. I hope you had fun. And I will see you all next time for some more Signalis.
Oh. 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 He needs some milk.